Hey what is going on guys, it is SuperbTube here and welcome back to another video. In today's video guys, I'm going to be going over how you can get the Quantum XL1 Power Armor from the Nuka World DLC in about 5 seconds, as opposed to the regular 5 hours of running around the map looking for star cores. Now guys, this glitch is incredibly easy, it literally takes 2 seconds to do, um, and this video is going to be incredibly short, but I, before we get into it, I do want to say we are so close to 1,000 subscribers, so let's get there, come on lads, if we all band together as a unit, we can do it. Also guys, please do make sure to like the video if you do enjoy, but let's get into it. So guys, the first thing that you're going to want to do is obviously have the Nuka World DLC installed. Now, all you're going to want to need is a power armor frame, you don't need any specific part on it, just any power armor frame, and you're good to go. So guys, this is my first time going to Nuka World, so I had to run around the entire gauntlet and defeat Coulter in this really bad set of power armor. It was a bit annoying, but once you've finally done that, once you're in Nuka World, all you want to do is head over to Starport Nuka in the Galactic Zone. Now guys, once you're there, you will be swarmed by a bunch of enemies, so just make sure you take them all out with your mighty power, and once you've done that, head over to where the X01 armor is. Now, as you can see, it is behind a glass case that will open once you've got all the star cards, but we don't have time for that. We have to get it right now. So what you want to do, guys, is with your power armor, stand uh, facing the glass, and you want to go into third person. Now, guys, what you want to do now is look over to the left and hold in A to exit the power armor, or hold in X or if you're on PS4. Um, and this will glitch the game. So what you want to do is do that and as soon as you're out of the power armor, as soon as you're out of it, you want to spam A or X or whatever button it is to get back in the power armor. Now, if you do this correctly, you should start to glitch out. When you climb back in the power armor, your model of your character doesn't match up with getting in the power armor, uh, and once that's complete, you should end up through the glass. So you might not be able to do this correctly on your first try, just make sure you keep going. I promise you this glitch still works. I literally did it yesterday. I did it on two characters. It worked perfectly fine. So guys, once you're in, obviously, now you just want to get out of your power armor and get into the X01 power armor. Now, if you've killed all the enemies, then you should be able to fast travel from there back to the Commonwealth and you're free to go. But if you haven't killed all the enemies like me, and I can't fast travel because enemies are nearby, what you want to do is head over to the glass and simply repeat the same thing. Look over to the left and hold in A so you exit the power armor and then immediately spam A to get back into the power armor and you should glitch through the glass. That's literally it guys, that's the glitch, it is the simplest thing on planet earth and I just wanted to share that with you because it's really useful. So guys that is the end of the video, if you did enjoy please do make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel, like I said we're so close to a thousand subscribers so let's do it. Anyway, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one, in a bit.